Welcome. I'm going to introduce you to a new and unusual trading system. It is unusual because it is based on a pair of trades you would think pointless. Furthermore, the strategy does not rely on choosing the correct market direction. It's a unique approach to market neutral trading. You won't need to short stocks, so you can trade this in your IRA account. It can be described as peer trading, but with an entirely new twist. In spite of these facts, this strategy will make excellent profits a good percentage of the time. It generates exceptional annual returns, even investing only a small portion of your equity. A little later, I'll show you the remarkable backtesting and live trading results. This strategy is for traders. You have had some experience trading options, although it can be auto-traded. It requires trading options in a fashion similar to trading the iron condor. I call this strategy the Counter Condor. This name was chosen because in many ways it is the opposite of the Iron Condor. Have you ever bought a stock only to watch it immediately go down? If you have been investing for any period of time, you have had this happen to you. I know it has happened to me. With the market volatility during the first week of August 2011, the Dow Jones Industrial Average went down 638 points in one day and up 646 the very next, only to go down over 536 the following. The next day, it went up 544 points. Most people cannot trade this type of market. Some try, but few succeed over time. In my market neutral strategy, you don't care whether the moves are up or down. In either case, you will make money. In fact, unlike the iron condor, the farther the market moves, the more money you make. Market neutral strategies are sometimes referred to as pair trading, statistical arbitrage, relative value arbitrage. They go by several different names. Large investment banks, institutions, and hedge funds spend millions of dollars each year developing pair trading strategies, but they have kept them hidden from the public. Peer trading strategies provide low risk and high reward returns to their investors. Recent studies show that this style of investing delivers superior returns with lower risk than any other form of investing, especially in volatile bear markets. Let's consider an example of peer trading. Here we have Google versus Yahoo. Google's chart is represented by the blue line. Yahoo is the red lower line. Google and Yahoo are both search engine providers, among other things. Historically, their stock prices have traded similarly. Look at both sides of the chart, and you can see they tend to move up and down together. However, at about the middle of the chart, you see that Google went sideways, but Yahoo dropped in price quite a bit, but then went sideways. Please note, in an IRA account, you cannot short a stock, so you wouldn't be able to do the Google-Yahoo trade. However, with Counter Condor, we use ETFs. You can accomplish what you want. When you see that two related stocks that normally trade the same diverge, it is time to start watching. 
In a traditional pair trade, you would sell short Google and buy Yahoo long. Your expectation is that eventually they will revert to their normal trading style. When they do, you will profit. Your risk is relatively low because you are short one underlying and long the other. When Yahoo began its march up to get back in step with Google, you would sell your positions in both holdings. Let's look at what happens when you trade leveraged ETFs simultaneously with their inverses. All six of these Direxion ETFs are three times leveraged. TNA represents the three times leveraged IWM, which is the Russell 2000, QLD, the NASDAQ 100, and FAS, the financial sector. The second of each pair is the inverse of the first. If on any given day you were to trade both members of any pair, at the end of the day you would expect to have neither a profit nor a loss. Here is a chart that will help you understand the concept of inverse ETFs. In this instance, I have chosen TNA, the bullish three times ETF, and TZA, the bearish three times ETF. These are leveraged ETFs. A 5% move in the underlying IWM results in a 15% move in TNA and TZA. Plotted on the same axis, you will see that they are inversely related. When one goes up, the other goes down. The price looks like mirrored images. If these pairs were constructed perfectly, their charts would be symmetric about the zero axis. It would look like a Rorschach. But that is not the case. As you can see, their center line falls at a rate of about 4% a month. Call that 4% friction in the system. Direxion, the company that provides these ETFs, have costs of operation. They need to make a profit too. This is where my study began. I wanted to see if I could take advantage of the friction. First, I wanted to be able to trade leveraged ETFs rather than individual stocks. These TNA, TZA ETFs are a derivative of the Russell 2000, represented by the ETF IWM. There are 2,000 stocks in IWM so we would have diversity. I also do not want to have to short a stock. People have fear of shorting stocks. I wanted to be able to trade this strategy in an IRA account. I wanted to have consistent, conservative, and profitable trades with very little drawdown. I began attacking the problem by testing to see if using options on TNA and TZA could produce the results I wanted. Here are some results of my early tests. As you can see, we wouldn't have liked trading either of these strategies. Nearly all of the trades were close to 100% losers. Like Edison, I kept trying until I eliminated all strategies that didn't work. Here's what I found that does work. Two special vertical spreads, each in the same direction, but they will be traded on paired ETFs facing in opposite directions. One of these will be a call and the other a put. One of the trades will be a debit and the other a credit. There are several possible combinations. I've developed a formula that tells us which combination will most likely win whether the market goes up or down. The result is that at expiration, 
When one of these spreads loses its value, the other gains even more. That's how I finally succeeded. Whenever a counter condor trade is considered, both the risk and reward of each ETF option combination is known. The potential reward of the pair trade is shown in green. It's the height of the wings in this chart. In this example, the wings are showing a potential 25% trade gain. Both wings are always the same height. The formula I developed tells which is the best trade pair combination. In addition, it allows me to decide if the trade will be worthwhile. Once the positions have been entered, this is truly a couch potato strategy. Agility is not required. Honestly, you have to be patient. The counter condor does not require day trading. It doesn't use stops. Just follow my overnight instructions and sit back and relax. Generally, two pair trades are put on shortly after expiration date has passed. Then they are closed just prior to the next expiration date. As the chart shows, there is an average gain well over 25% per trade. The account realizes more than a 30% growth per year. About 90% of the trades were winning trades. That's pretty good for a couch potato strategy. By the way, theoretical data was not used in these tests. Think or Swim, a sophisticated brokerage service, provides actual option trade data in its back tester. Therefore, I use their trade data rather than computing the theoretical price of the option. In the live trading, the average gain was over 23.96% per trade, with 88.24% winning trades. You can have losing trades, but they are not frequent. You must plan for the rare possibility of multiple losing trades in a row. Unlikely things do happen. I recommend not trading more than 5% of your equity in any trade. In this example, only 5% of the account is going to be at risk in any trade. Initially, the $100,000 account will only trade $5,000. Reviewing the backtesting data, this allocation plan has only a small drawdown. Live trading from March 2012 through July 2013 produced close results. The average gain per trade was 23.51% compared with 25% in the example. The largest losing trade was 27.66%. Reinvesting the gains resulted in a compound rate of return of 15.05%. This chart is based on the live trades. It assumes only one trade per month. In only 16 months, the account grew from $100,000 to over $120,000. In most months, you will be able to have two trades per month. This should have your account growing at greater than 30% per year. I focus on these two pair of ETFs because of their liquidity. Other pair trades are available if either of these two do not show an adequate potential return. Each pair of option trades is naturally hedged. Stops are never used. This strategy permits owners of IRAs to compete on a level field with all other traders. Counter Condor is truly market neutral. It doesn't care whether the market goes up or down. 
Kana Kangar hits a sweet spot. Every one of its statistics are ideal. The average gain per trade, the percent of winning trades, the list goes on. Just place these trades and wait for expiration. There is no need to stare at the computer nervously watching the market. By placing two pair trades per month, allocating only 5% of the portfolio's equity to each trade, I'm aiming for over a 30% rate of growth. Trading the counter condor leaves at least 90% of your equity available for other trades. My plan includes a number of low-risk, high-probability option strategies. They are short-term, initially designed to expire in 20 to 50 days. The trades only aim to earn 1 to 3% per month. With several of these active each month, significant additional annual earnings should be realized. 94% of the SPX and IWM bull put spreads on these broad market indices have been successful. The back ratio and the Jade Lizard are bullish trades with no risk no matter how much the underlying price rises. Their probability of success is better than 68%. At the time of this video, 13 out of 13 of the Jade Lizard trades were winners. Suppose you are following a stock and it's just before earnings. You think the report will be good, but fear the consequences if it isn't. The bear protected spread is ideal for you. Other high probability trades, such as trading broad market indices with the iron condor, might be added selectively. I've shown you that outstanding returns can be generated with my plan. No more than 5% of equity need ever be risked on any trade. Detailed and timely guidance for the plant's trades are available through my newsletter email notes. For information about subscribing to the newsletter or any of my trading strategies, contact me either by phone or email. Thank you for watching this video.